I'm Tom and this is Tangerine Quarantine and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a stick man like this out of a stick like this. Firstly you're going to need a stick with as many twigs sprouting off it as possible. These act as the arms and legs so if you can find ones with the branches sort of next to each other that's pretty good. The first step to making your stick man is to remove all the excess sticks. Unless you want to make a, uh, a spider stick man, in which case you might want to keep some. However, for this guy, I'm just going to go for a normal man. So, firstly, I'm going to take off all the unnecessary twigs. I'm just going to snap them. Now that you have the four arms and legs of your stick man, you're going to want to make sure that they're the same or about the same length. This is to make it proportional. So I look at this stick, it's a bit shorter than this one, so I just snap the end off. That looks a bit better. I'm going to go onto the legs. I reckon around here, be fine. And then that means we snap this leg here. And that is basically the stick man done for construction. If you're a bit more of an adventurous scout, you might want to shave some of the bark off so that it's easier to paint and draw on. However, if you're a cub or a beaver, this is not necessary if you don't want to, and the application will only be a bit easier if you do. Now that your stick man is peeled, it's time to get to the fun part, which is drawing on it. For this, you can either use paint, sharpies, or just any pen really, it will work fine. Okay, so here's my stick man. Just check over, see which side is smoother, that's probably the best one to do the face on. Now I can only find a silver and black sharpie, so they're the ones I'm going to use. So I do have some more colours here. Okay, so I'm going to start with a face. Sometimes it can be a bit hard because it's a rounded surface, but really this is just to show off your artistic talent. I'm not very artistic, so there's not much I can do. But I'm sure all of you have got the skills to make a much more interesting stick person than this. Just put some silver polka dots on it. Maybe I'll get out a red brush. If you, if you paint directly onto the bark, you will have to wait for the ink to dry. Now you have a new friend in this quarantine period. 